Okay, next one is example 7. What diameter must an aluminium wire have if its resistance is to be same as of that an equal length of copper wire with diameter of 22.2 millimeter? Okay, um, it's quite hard to understand here. Okay, so basically, we have a wire of aluminium. So we have aluminium. And then we have a wire of copper. So, so I let me tell you sini, what diameter must an aluminium wire have? So we want to have, we want to find the diameter of this aluminium. Okay, if its resistance is to be the same. Okay, as as that of an equal length of copper wire okay meaning that here if the resistance of the so resistance of the aluminium meaning that must be the same with the resistance of the copper and the length also the same length of the aluminium also the same with the long the, the length of the copper so and then bagi tahu lagi dekat sini diameter Okay, diameter 2.2 millimeter. Diameter of the copper. So, diameter of the copper 2.2 millimeter. Okay, so that is the information that we have. Okay, since they bagi um, condition dekat sini, condition dia adalah resistance sama, length pun sama. Okay, so how do we find this diameter of aluminium? So, using the formula of resistivity, which is P is equal to RA okay, RA divided by L and then kita boleh susun dia ikut this one lah kalau kita ikut this one R, RA is equal to RC so we arrange that one we will get okay, R is equal to PL divided by A okay, um, A dekat sini adalah area area is equal to pi r square kan but since here we want to find the diameter so kita ubah kepada ubah sikit lah formula ni kepada diameter d square divided by 4 ok since um radius is equal to twice the diameter right oh sorry 2 radius ok diameter is equal to 2R right So masukkan saja Kita akan dapat Pi D square over 4 Ok so here Meaning that Our new formula That, that we are going to use Is Pi D square over 4 Ok so Since resistance Aluminium will be equal to Resistance of copper So masukkan Resistivity of aluminium Times with the Length of the aluminium equal to oh sorry divided by pi d d dekat sini adalah diameter of the aluminium square divided by four and then here p c l c divided by pi d c square divided by four okay now since length dekat sini sama kan length sama so kita boleh um, cancel that out and then apa lagi benda yang sama pi sama 4 pun sama boleh cancel so sekarang ni kita tinggal uh, resistivity divided by the diameter so masukkanlah value yang ada so resistivity dia bagi kan untuk aluminium this one and then untuk copper is this one so masukkan value tu 2.75 eksponen negatif 8 divided by diameter of the aluminium square this one we don't have the value ni yang kita mau kira and then resistivity for the copper 1.72 exponent negative 8 divided by the diameter so diameter untuk copper is this one 2.2 exponent negative 3 square so dA diameter of the aluminium will be equal to 2.78 exponent negative 3 meter. Okay, so that will be the solution for example 7.